Good evening all. We did a wild bad chip here on this morning. Join me after the intro and I'll tell you all about it. Bosh. Good evening all. Welcome to the channel. My name's Richard Vida. Thank you very much for being here. I'm just out on an evening ride in the glorious Derbyshire hills at golden hour. Uh, just to tell you about um, something we did this morning. We had a wild bad chippy run, but a uh, chippy run with a difference. About 60 of us met at the departure lounge and uh, we proceeded to have a nice, a nice short 40 mile route through the peaks over to Dromfield to the um, new premises of Supreme Coat, the ceramic coating people. It was their open day of their brand new premises. It was fantastic actually, we had a cracking time. We did the drop off, worked flawlessly, thanks to you lot, thank you very much. And then when we got to Supreme Coat, we had tea and coffee, and then we had free fish and chips. Free! 60 of us, free fish and chips. Thank you very much everybody for coming, it was lovely to meet some new faces. There are a couple of motorbike uh, simulators to go around the racetrack at Donington and uh, Supreme Coat even did a little trophy thing, a little presentation at the end. First, second and third for the fastest lap. Our very own Gaz came third. He's not, he's not one bit competitive, our Gaz. I came about, um, we had 60 people there. I think I came about uh, 89th. <laughs> crap at those kind of things enough chatting about it luckily I filmed it so let's rewind to this morning and show you a little bit of the route and what we got up to at the open day and then you can join me back here afterwards to see what I'm up to tonight I'll see you in a minute folks roll that rewind We're doing the wild by Chippy Run. 60 of us. Let's go. I'm doing the drop off system. So we've got 60 bikes in tow for this wild bad chippy run with a difference. We're going up to my channel sponsors, Supreme Coat, who do the ceramic coating. It's their open day of their new premises. So I thought I'd take the opportunity to do it as a wild bad chippy run because they're gonna give us some free fish and chips when we're there. That's pretty good, isn't it? We chose a bloody good day for it and all because of the weather, I think we're at about 20 degrees, yeah, just under 20 degrees. And it's giving it nice now for a, Good week, I think. We're just coming up to the junction, so I'm going to sit at the junction. Oh, okay, so you're not that far ahead of us. No, like I said, we're just coming up to the junction now, so I'll stop, so we can all be in line. I don't think there's anything in between us, actually, so I'll just wait. Yeah, we're coming up to the junction now. Uh, oh no, we're not, we're coming into the village bit now. Oh yeah, I can start to see rest at the bank now. Yeah, we're caught up, dude. I'll just let us catch in. Over there if you can, mate, thank you very much. All good? Just letting the group catch up a bit. It's a nice view. I can see Kev. Tell me when you um, stop, mate. Right, we're st I'm basically, we're all queuing to go off at Junction now. Right, that's it then, Brill. Ready? Oh, you're there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's it, let's go. Just about to turn up Longway Bank. Are 
are you on long way bank now then yes mate yeah fantastic yeah good it's a bit more manageable when there's only uh, 50 of us 60 of us whatever there is not 200 off All right, mate. Danny's at to mark. I didn't want Danny to have to mark, but he's actually doing really well. That's Danny on the monkey bike. That just shows you folks, actually. I've, I've had this before with people saying about the weekender and all oh, 125s allowed and things like this. Of course they're allowed. And the route, the route that we do and the ride that we do is not particularly fast because you've got to cater for everybody involved. Excuse me, everyone. Hi, mate. Danny's at to mark. Danny's at to mark, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll keep an eye on him. We're not going too fast for him, no way. We're just saying on camera, you know, it just shows you that if Danny can be in the mix and, and, and cope very well with it, then anyone can, can't they? Exactly, exactly. Just at the junction now. Just got Danny. And you were worried about being a marker. I'm all right till we get to Hills. Yeah, as I was just saying, folks, um, it just shows you having someone that's on a monkey bike in the middle of all this, that's otherwise really big bikes, it really doesn't matter what you're riding because our routes are not and, and runs are not fast. And we've got a marker on every junction, so you can't go wrong. Danny's not holding anybody up at all. So it just shows you that you can really, you can join us on these big rides and it doesn't matter what you ride. So one thing, one thing less for you to worry about. Kerber Edge now. He's indicated, he's spotted. Yep, we've got it, we've got it, we've got it. Well done, people. It's a big, long, straight road. It'll get us all in line for a photo. I think I can see you at distance. Yeah. You're on straight road, aren't you? Yes, mate. <laughs> He's got his arse out again. Uh, I don't even need to tell you who it is. <laughs> <laughs> is that you, guys, at back? Yeah. Yes, mate, I'm here. That's looking lovely. Look at you, lovely lot, tailing there, it looks mega. Right, this is the Olabar roundabout, which is a bit of a tricky one, so I need to figure out where I'm putting people here. It could go wrong here, so let's uh, hope it doesn't. Perfect. And we've got seven more miles to go. Go. Go, 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 go,
good. You did that brilliantly. Barkers were perfect. Excellent. to open, officially open, yes. um, new Supreme Thanks ever so much. Everybody welcome, so <laughs> can we get to do it? Right. Yeah, just yes. do another round shake. Just do it. 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 Thank you so much for opening. Richie, just do another round shake. 11th of June 2022. Thank you so much. Thank you. Supreme Cups open, everybody! Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I've got to include him on that, I've got to be fair, answer. So, what does he get for the... For the he gets a £50. Uh, what about massage? No, you wouldn't just get a massage. <laughs> He's asked me three times for the massage, <laughs> and I said I can't, I'm married, so I can't. Anyway, happy thank you for asking me. <laughs> yeah, anyone's happy ending. I'll be able to sort of play this out. He's been leading up to this, saying I've got good hands and all this. I'm, I'm getting worried about him, but do you know what he's so happy? I'm not embarrassed him, mate. I'm not embarrassed him, mate. So basically, the winner gets £50 vouchers to spend in the shop, so once you get your vouchers, the winner's looking at me excited. Yeah. <laughs> Look to uh, yeah. Superstar yeah. Twice uh, Silver. This way's a freaking ton and all, so, yeah. right. yeah. so congratulations. Come on, meet the Jeff. There you have it folks, what a cracking day, what a cracking day we've had and again what a lovely bunch of people, 60 of us, around 60 of us, and it was just lovely, just really, really lovely. Look at all this. Look at that. farm down there nothing round it that farm over there nothing round it that farm there nothing round it Ooh, look at these houses oh, it's stunning you cannot beat the countryside folks oh man I feel so privileged to be able to live and ride in an area like this really do <laughs> look at this What a lovely summer's ride. Well, I'll put my on. Have a minute. All right. Just pop that there a second. Thanks very much everybody that turned out for the chippy run and the uh, open day of Supreme Coat's new premises. Thanks to Supreme Coat for looking after everybody and buying fish and chips from all. I for one really appreciated it and I know everybody else did. People have come from far and wide. Southampton, Hailing Island. Brilliant, you, you guys, just brilliant. I wish you the best of luck. That is one stonking premises you've got there. If anybody out there is wanting the bikes ceramic coated, that's who you need to call. Link in description below. Hope you all got home safe. 
Thank you for all doing an amazing job with the drop-off system. Well, I've no idea where I am, but I'm bloody well enjoying it. It's Saturday evening, sunset ride. Fantastic. Oh, and my hay fever is coming back. I had that Kenlog injection last year, last summer. And I've been, hang on, here it comes. <laughs> I've been in denial, I said, I'm not gonna have the injection again until I feel I need it, just to see how long. And it's, you know, the second I had it last year, it sorted me out immediately and I had not a single, not a single symptom. It was like magic juice being pumped into my arm. From the moment it went in, not a single symptom and uh, I know the pollen count is very high at the moment, but yeah, it's just starting to creep back now. I'm finding my eyes itching like mad and I'm starting to sneeze like mad. So I booked in to have it uh, done again. In a, is it next week or week after? Sat nav has not one time gone wrong. I've bloody cracked it. Thanks to the guy this morning that came on the chippy run. I'm sorry, mate, I didn't get your name, but yeah, you're exactly right. It has sorted it. Come out tonight doing a really intricate route on purpose and it's not once deviated from what it's supposed to do. We've got Kalimoto running at the same time. It's done perfect. Perfect. I'll do another video explaining what I've just mentioned there about the sat nav and what I've done to make it do exactly what I ask it. It was to the point where it's almost as if like uh, the GPX that I was sending to it was in the Queen's English and what was coming out was Geordie. <laughs> it it kind of made sense but it doesn't make sense. Um, but now it does. It's followed exact, as you can see, look. Exact. Nine o'clock on a Saturday evening. All right, while I wait for this red light to change, I'm gonna bugger off. Thanks very much for watching all. Thanks to Darren for putting on a great show today. Thank you all for coming out. Thanks for doing a great job with the drop off. Hopefully see you all soon and I'll see a lot of you next month at the Wabad Weekender. Last few tickets available, folks. Come on, snap them up. We've built it for you to enjoy, so get it done. What a stunning evening. Oh, American flag there. There's a grave. Thanks very much for watching folks, I'm going to enjoy the rest of this trip in peace without you lot, with your praying eyes. Thank you very much, it's been a pleasure, I'll see you on the next one sometime soon. Be good, be careful and be bloody well kind, see you soon folks. <laughs>